Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss the topic is Q mock interview questions. A few basic mock interview questions on Lightning Web Components. So let's start. One is which kind of files a Lightning Web Component requires. That is HTML files where we can define the markup for user interface. And another thing is the JavaScript file where we define the logic. Configuration file where we define configurations which will be useful for exposing your lightning web component. Can you say the names of few decorators in lightning web component implementation? The main decorators of lightning web component implementation based on the situations, those are all API, track, wire. Okay. There is different kind of uh, purposes for each and every decorator. So based on the need, you can use this decorators to define your properties. Okay, now let's go to next question. How can you import multiple decorators? You can use import statement in JavaScript class and you can import decorators like this. Okay, so here lightning element is not a decorator. It is a wrapper from the lightning web component framework. <coughs> and what is the basic structure of JavaScript file in lightning web component? When you create a lightning web component, then it will be the basic structure will be with this with one import statement one export statement here import statement will be useful for importing the lightning element module and export statement will define a default class for javascript file where you can define your logic okay and here one more point is basically when you create a lightning web component the name of the class will become a name of the lightning web component name okay so but you can rename also according to best practice it's better to maintain the same name of lightning web component as class name also. and what is required to expose a component what is required to expose our lightning web component okay that is if exposed tag should be set to true where we can set this is exposed tag in configuration file that is meta file in the lightning web component basically in la lightning web component configuration file or meta file <coughs> you can uh, configure a lightning web component to be exposed to app builder okay and uh, you can define the properties you can define the targets this kind of things you can do in configuration file and I have created one trial mix okay for you and you can go through this trial mix for learning lightning with components I have uh, uh, combined all together all uh, trial heads related to the lightning web components along with the SFDX tools you can go through that okay because <clears throat> when you want to implement lightning web components you can't use developer console first of all you can use sfdx that is salesforce cli commands to create lightning web components if you use vs code editor you can easily create lightning web components because it has cli inbuilt and uh, you can have uh, salesforce extensions also in vs vs code 